To get the advantage over the Griever right off the bat, you're going to want to walk forward and time this attack carefully on this ice. You're going to want to do it right before the cutscene. I'll show it again. Right before the cutscene, you're going to want to try to get an attack animation in to clear that pathway for that train cart. When she crawls down, you want to quickly get as much ice out of the way as possible. Now, the Griever has this energy beam that alters the state of the ice, and it kind of makes it unbreakable. Hence the red glow. You see me sticking over here to the right, you just want to stay tight over here and dodge your ass off. Got all the ice, head back to the train cart. When you throw the card at her the first time, stick around that area because she'll throw it right back at you. Do it quickly because she's going to lead off with an attack and you might take a hit, but it'll be worth it if you can get this one off. Hitting her twice with the cart brings her down, giving you the opportunity to inflict major damage on her. But first you'll need to bust her chest open with the tremor gauntlet. After hitting her, she will always follow up with that slam attack. The Griever will eventually summon her babies and kill these guys however you need to. They can be pretty annoying attacking one after another consecutively. Ultimately though, just know that you have the time to kill them, so don't feel rushed. When Griever does rock slide, get yourself out into the open area, make a huge circling pattern using blood to measure your distance. When attacking the Griever, I personally like to use the Whirlwind combo. Okay, it can get tricky on her counter slam. Sometimes you actually get sucked up behind her instead of pushed back out, and which in turn it it just pushes your cart back and it causes more problems because the further cards away, that's more ground you gotta gain and less time that she's getting fucked up. Another potential thing that could go wrong is that if you don't make your circle wide enough or don't make your pattern large enough, misjudge your distance, anything like that, you could get hit with the rocks. Throw the card at her one more time and Pop's got a brand new bag. <laughs> 